it's really the human condition is to survive. It is really not to be special. And I think where we all make a mistake as a coach, maybe as a business leader, is that we assume that the people that are out there working with us have the desire to be the best that they can be. And, and to win a championship, to win a national championship, to win an SEC championship, it's really special and it's a special accomplishment for all the people and the people who did it are special because it's not normal. And we all assume that it's normal sometimes. But it's really the mental conditioning, how they think, what they believe, what their goals are, what their commitments are to a standard of excellence that they buy into that makes a difference in how well they perform. But the first thing that I said, the personal development side is the most important because it affects everything else that the guy does. We also have a mountain, and it had every game of the season in terms of climbing a mountain. And the players understood what it took to get to the summit. And you understand those words that we say, you never heard win the game one time and all that. There, there was not one win the game in there. It was all about dominating the competition, dominating your opponent, be the best you can be, sell out for the team. All, all, all the things that you hear about all the time in terms of what's important to being successful and maximizing performance and getting people to work together so that they can accomplish something that's significant. You know, we have a pyramid of success at our place, which is kind of sort of what defines being a champion. And you've got to have a team full of champions before you're ever going to win a championship. And I think that's where we sometimes get a little misguided. You know, we, we live in such a result-oriented world. Everything's about results. And very little is about the process of what it takes to get the results. And I think our organization is different because everything that we do is about the process of what it takes to get the results. Even our pyramid of success, it doesn't say win a championship at the top, it says be a champion. Because we're constantly looking for people to help reinforce that kind of thought process in the people in our organization, everyone in our organization. And I can tell you, it's worked very effectively for us for many, many years. And I can tell you that the people at the Pacific Institute have done a marvelous job of elevating the level of that success uh, even more for us in the past year that they've been involved. And uh, we interviewed three different organizations and by far the most professional um, organization, uh, the one that was most willing to adapt to work with the other people in our organization to input our organization and put sort of their mark on it without violating all the other things that we were doing was the people in the Pacific Institute. Um, and they were willing to get in the college arena. You know, they, they had worked with Coach Pete Carroll at Southern Cal. Uh, and I'm no Pete and liked what they did there. And he gave them a tremendous recommendation. So that's kind of what we had done.